I forget to pay my DTE bill all the time. And I pay it late. Uh, and then like, it's just, do they call me? It's like DTE gas field. And I'm like, oh shit. And it's like, my, <laughs> my fucking bill's like eight days overdue. And I'm like, fuck. <laughs> Every month. Dude, I, I paid like 10 late fees since owning that house. And Jen, like, Jen's like, did you pay the DT bill? And I'm like, uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a piece I of shit. My, I do that with my mortgage. And then, I get, shit. and then I get pieces of mail in that are, that are in full red. And it's like, well, the, we're taking your house. The only thing with the mortgage is I have that on auto pay. I have my oh. truck on I have so many things on auto pay because I'm stupid and I won't pay them. Yeah. So things not on auto pay, like my DTE bill, the wind up bill and stuff, I like will forget. Don't say, Dude, don't, I'm an idiot. Don't tell people wind up. They don't know. Oh, yeah, they don't live. know where we live. Our um, fans downriver. Uh, we live in Canada. We live in the streets of New. Of we live in the streets of uh, Old Saint Helen. Don't you think uh, Canadian, American, everything should China? No, you know what? We already did this. Yeah, I know, but it's fun. But <laughs> we already did this. Uh, okay, so. <laughs> That's uh, funny though. We're getting now. We're just getting to the point where we got bits. We're rehashing. <laughs> like, yeah, we already did. I think we did this before. Yeah. yeah. Then I want <laughs> Ameri- because uh, we're the first. You're a Canadian American. I was like, and you're like I immediately get, like Chris came up with this, and I hate it. I didn't get it <laughs> until I said China, in, and I went, wait a minute. I feel like I've said that yeah, word yeah. before. Yeah, I actually started saying it wrong. You Chinese piece of shit. That's what I say to every Chinese person. Because that it would be American. I'm getting myself canceled. Because I A N that would be to the end of every country is what it is. What that would Sorry. be if I like scored something crazy and they like found this and they're like, yeah, you're fired, dude. You're fucked. Uh-huh. Do, it, do it again. Uh-huh. Sorry. Uh-huh. People think, oh, they added a little piece to it. <laughs> Didn't. Uh-huh. There's like a little dog they're punching or something. Oh yeah, did I tell you about these dogs that aren't real? <laughs> <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah, the Ben thing. So, this is a goofy guy we know named Ben. Big Ben. Ben Wallace. <coughs> so, not Ben Wallace. <clears throat> yeah, he's white. He's a white fuck. And, uh... He's a, he's the white devil. No, so, this is, yeah, everyone white is the devil. Is the devil. It's true. Riding my bike. I mean, white people are the ones shooting kids in schools. So yeah, is it a, is it a hundred percent? Dude, like I one, I dude, one is some somebody. I'm else. pretty sure every mask like shooter is a. I mean, it's probably the exception of a few. I mean, I don't know. I haven't researched this. It's white but people, there's a that, white guy. Yeah, white people that just don't leave their house. Yeah, and then they're finally like, "All right, I'm going out there." Dude, and I'll tell you this: none of them are women. Yeah. So what does hey, that tell hey, you? Hey, women. women step are, it up. Yeah, women are allowed. Yeah, either women need to step it up or only women are allowed to buy guns. Dude, yeah. I saw, I know that you're about to say a thing. No, you're good. But I I'm like about that. To, I'm about to steal this bit from this guy. I saw a video of this guy. He, I don't even, I've never even heard of this guy before. I don't remember his name. Yeah. He, but he was doing a bit, a comedian. He was doing a same thing. And he said, because uh, it was like, he said the number of people that like men have killed and like shootings. And it was like, I mean, insane. And then he said, like, oh, and yeah. then since it was like, so it was like since 1970, whatever, this many, like, so many people killed by men. And then it was like women. And it was like two or three yeah. or something. And it was like, so, and then they, so he's like, so it was like, and what did he say? It was something like, guy, you're only allowed to have two guns. And he's like, one long gun, one short gun. And then he was like, and if you're a white guy, you have to, and he, he had all this thing, but the funny part I wanted to get to, he was like, and then to use that gun, or no, he was like, women are allowed to have anything they want. Armored helicopters, this, <laughs> and he was like, and then if for men to use their gun, you got to ask a woman. And this is what's going to happen. Where are you going? Who are you going to be with? How long are you? <laughs> and I was, like, I was like, that's a pretty funny bit. That's good. Yeah. That's good. I like that. Like, it was like all the classic tropes, but I was like, I don't know. That's a good way to put it in the gun, like the whole gun reform bit. I don't know. I thought it was pretty good. And was he like sort of like a no like a no name guy? Not like I've never seen him nothing. before, but he seemed yeah. like an older like maybe he's like in his forties. Oh, so. I mean, not like being in your forties. He's like, oh well, you automatically. I just but I, it, was a, it was a good bit. I think about how some of those some good bits literally just no one ever hears about them because oh, they're with like a lesser guy or people don't know the guy. It's a lesser. I don't want to say lesser yeah, guy. Lesser known. Sorry. Yeah. Lesser known I mean, comedian. I'm a, I'm a not known. We're nobody. Yeah. You know, what my brother does. Oh good. I was talking to someone. Texts me about stuff. That yeah. I was talking <laughs> to someone, 
And he's next to me, and he goes, he goes, uh, Chris is going to be uh, <laughs> I already I'm like, dude. He's going to be a, a great comedian. I was like, um, I'm nothing. Yeah. I was like, um, stop. This is horrible. And now I'm going to repeat it on something where I should never talk about it. Uh, it's getting recorded. Okay. No, but, uh, um, hey now, hey now. So, Ben. Yeah. I see Ben. And, you know, I got a shaved head. Some people now are shocked. Nice. Which I don't think about because uh, my hair's always been short. It's not that, like, different. And then I shave my head. So I, I see him. a little shocking. Oh, really? Sometimes I'm like, oh, whoa. Oh, really? So there it is. So that's the truth. So, and then I go, cancer boy is here. Oh, boy. Little boy's got cancer. Little boy's got cancer. It's just like ball, like a shaved head, like the jokes are, you're a cancer yeah. or you're a Nazi. Yeah. <laughs> I know. What the fuck? He's either dying or he's a g- giant piece of shit racist fuck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And I'm afraid about that because I go play basketball and. With black people. And. No, dude. How many? There's like ball boy guys in the NBA. There's one I'm picturing. I just don't know his name. You know what I was wondering the other day? El Gaskis. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> El Gaskis. There's all these, uh, you know, there's all these things where they're like, uh, Elvis got his feeling like in groove and all that dumb shit. Uh, well, it's not dumb, but whatever. His thing, his stick, they took from like already good, profound uh, black artists. Oh, yeah. And then yeah. everything and was stolen. A bunch of rock people. and roll stuff was like stolen. And then. A bunch of these things that are stolen. And there's like a long line of history of people being like, oh, or or maybe it's popularized by uh, black culture and then we start doing something, uh, white people, and then we kill it. It dies because we ruined it. Um, I mean, we do do that. So that's what happens. Here's but a I was cool, thinking. There's a cool slang word that everyone's using. And the white people are like, we got it. And then it's like, nah, okay, we don't need it anymore. I was thinking about this. Who was shaving their head first? I, don't know. I feel like maybe some fucked up Nazi kind of dudes might have shaved their head, you know, when uh, black people in America at least had a lot of froze and shit, and they're like, uh, you know, they're trying to get r- right yeah. human rights and shit. Know. And then uh, I don't know if you see like, and then the NBA actually nowadays the NBA dudes are not doing it as much. Did Michael Jordan make that like a huge thing in the nineties? What shaving your head? I feel like a ton of black dudes. Oh, just like the in basketball right now don't have shaved heads. A lot of dudes they got. We got cool especially after style. especially after COVID, a lot of dudes were like, "We're letting it go." We're letting it was kind of sick. Some dudes had '80s froze and shit. Yeah, '70s froze. Whatever decade you want, pick '60s one. froze. Pick one, '50s. So you 50s saw fro- ben. '40s froze. Yeah, so <laughs> I pull up and uh, someone. He, w- there's one person waiting for the Ben story, and yeah. they're like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> and he he doesn't. Uh, Recognize me because I'm bald. And I go, hey, man, what's going on? He goes, oh, oh, oh. He's like, you know, double taking. What the fuck? So the Nazis going to attack me? Where is this? <clears throat> By Elizabeth Park. Oh, okay. I was bar- biking over there. And he goes. <laughs> he goes. <laughs> he's like, oh, I did, didn't recognize you. I thought you were a Nazi. you going to come guzzle my ass. And then, uh, <laughs> and then he he's sitting there and I. And I go, oh, I didn't recognize you. I thought it was GSP. <laughs> it's an ongoing thing that this guy, Ben, thought he had a similar body type to uh-huh. GSP, <laughs> which, nope. GSP is... GSP, George St. Pierre, fighter. MMA. Uh, Ben's just a, a downriver white walking a very small dog. And so... Uh, downriver white. So the, the whole thing is I'm talking to him. And uh, just saying, hey, I just literally wanted to acknowledge a person. Like, at the very least, that's all I ever want is like, hey, yeah. and then continue with life. You know, especially at, at the gym. I, I'll see someone I haven't seen in forever, and <gasps> I, I kind of want to go, hey, and then they go, oh, Chris. And then I go, hey. And, I, and then it sucks when everyone's like, yeah, so, so like, what's life? The guy takes his headphones off, takes his yeah. coat off, or whatever. I don't know why he's wearing a coat. And then <laughs> working out. A park. Yeah. He takes his park off, and he's like, hey, man, let's go. He starts hugging me, and I'm like, all right, well, this has already gone too far and too long. But So Ben's talking to me. He's got his little dog. So he's got a doggy bag full, full of a turd. And uh, he doesn't realize, but he starts lecturing me. Or, you know, I don't know. 
not really, but he's like explaining something and he's talking and the other one hand's holding the, the dog's leash and the little dog and that thing's like, like how little dogs do. And uh, I'm like, get rid of it. And then <laughs> his other hand has the doggy poop and I'll, and then he's, he's like, as he's Flinging talking, it. so like, I, yeah, I start talking and then, it, and then he starts talking in the conversation. And he's like, yeah, so like, that's what I, and he's just uh. got in his hand and it's just turd flopping left uh. and right. And I look, I was like, I got to do I'm blocking out everything. He's he, like if it was like a sitcom, it'd show my point of view just slowly. Like they would be like, wah, 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 yeah, wah, 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 wah. the blur focus. Yeah, the mode. blur focus. I, I it would to narrow tunnel vision on this floppy turd in his hand, and uh, I go, I'm sorry, man. I can't really pay attention to what you're saying or even hear you while you're flopping a turd at me. <laughs> and he was like, no, 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 <laughs> no, no, I'm not the, no. And then he puts his hand down, he starts talking, and then he kind of starts using his <laughs> hand again. I go, you're doing it, man. <laughs> He's fucking flopping a turd around. I go, I can't wait to tell your brothers. Because there's just endless uh, yeah, Ben things, Ben-isms. His brothers and Justin. Tell his brothers and Oh, Justin. you know what? I have not told Justin. Shaw would be like, oh, there was like a nine other stories. Yeah, I love when he goes. <laughs> oh, yeah. Ben. <laughs> Getting him oh. started is my favorite thing. <clears throat> it was like the, Ben is like what Anthony used to be. I would just be like, so, uh, Anthony? And then he'd be like, dude. And I would be dude. like, this, this is great. He robs his grandmother. Yeah. And like, oh, God. I mean, some of the stuff I heard, I was like, <laughs> I mean, that's pretty fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> he probably like killed her. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. It's a joke. Yeah, she could be dead. She's Bernie. Which I think she is. Oh, shit. I'm sorry. Yeah. She <laughs> passed away. Oops. <laughs> I mean, it's a while ago. So When it's a while ago, it doesn't matter. To the 28 listeners, I'm sorry. You know, I was listening to um, yeah. some other podcasts, and yeah. these people will be like, uh, like Chris Allen. He's like, he goes, you know, I like doing this, but I'm not going to just keep doing it. Like, not talking about the episodes. He was just talking about some other, like, segment of his show, whatever. And he goes... But if I only got this many listeners, I'm like, and it was just like the smallest number ever. And I was like, he could be exaggerating, but he sounded so serious. And I was like, he's got like 10 more listeners than us. <laughs> That's what it felt like. I was, wow. like. I was like, that sucks. Do we still get listens? Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> Do we still get listens? I, just, I mean, I, not YouTube, but people yeah, well, listen no, to YouTube podcasts. Sucks. Yeah. I, I only do that because I'm like, somebody does. Somebody, maybe. I, our friend Adam and a couple other people yeah. have told me. Yeah, or I've seen. Sometimes you get a when you get a whole crew. YouTube su- sucks. Um, well, yeah, but then if we're on the podcast, that we can play out the songs. <laughs> yeah. Well, yeah, that's th- they stay on there. Yeah. Well, yeah. So. I feel like I feel like you just skipped forty-seven pages. So I'm on, I'm on bank six. Jesus. Isn't that cute? But it's wrong! Uh, so you started... P90X. <laughs> <laughs> I started... Uh, oh, fucking, that, that guy was just shredded. I started Orange Theory. Oh, I don't know if I sent you this clip. I feel like I can hear you doing whatever you're doing. Maybe. I, could, I was like... <laughs> but he, <laughs> he goes... Uh, there was this video. Damn it, I should have found it. I was trying to explain it to Jordan, too, and I was like, I'm a moron. I, I Let me go recite the video, <laughs> study it, and then I'll come back and tell you what it was. Or I wish I could just send the video. But it's like this New Zealand dude or Australian, I don't, who knows their accents. And the guy was explaining, he goes, um, you know, people play sports, and then who makes the teams? The, the most athletic and fastest and and more in shape and genetically. Yeah. Uh, gifted people mm-hmm. make the teams. This starts from an early age, and then easily, like very quickly and early on, people who aren't genetically gifted or maybe strong and fast, blah blah blah, are just get weaned up, and then so that happens. So then, like guys who like just get kicked out of, like just barely don't make the NBA, NFL, all these big leagues, they're still uh, like elite athletes. Yeah. They just barely don't make these things. So a lot of these people turn into trainers, and then they're the ones telling you what you have to eat and telling you how to work out and all this stuff. And it's like you are you have that body because you were like gifted yeah. with that body. It's yeah. like me and Corey could never achieve that body. Yeah, right. And uh, uh, it's just that we don't have the – it's just you not almost, gonna happen. You almost need a smart person who like understands 
bodies that like knows nutrition yes. and stuff and how but we keep different. going to all these popular things that it's just like a giant meathead he's like this is what you need to do yeah and it's like well yeah, i'll never be able to achieve that yeah um certain people just can't and it's the same thing with like some people have like certain thyroid issues it's like they can um get a better diet and work out wildly and it and it would be it'd be beneficial mm-hmm. but they're not going to be you ever they're yeah. not going to be these amazing fitness people like uh I was reading something about like abs and some people like uh I was a twig my whole life never had abs. Yeah. Why does how do they how, I, I was a twig. I weighed 130 didn't have abs. It was just like a flat. It was just like flat. And then some people have like these big bulky abs. I'm uh, bulk ads, fuck. Abs. Yeah. Bulk shit. So, I just thought the guy pointed out like very obvious things that I never even thought about That's before. A cool I was guy. like, "Oh my god, I like this guy." I was like, and then he's like, "So yeah, guys, you see McDonald's put video games." Nice, <laughs> dude. I like. I don't know. Maybe it's because I. The I guy mean, also had more things to say. He had, it was like a longer video, and it was. I was like, "Oh, okay, I cool. have like no problem being active. Oh, getting out. Yeah, like bike riding, hiking, like doing fun stuff at the gym. But like." I see like like my friends and stuff like they're posting pictures they're, like they're like at the gym Me. and I'm just like, <laughs> I mean everyone's life is different yeah. but I just feel like with my schedule, I'm just like, <laughs> I'm not doing that. Yeah. Like I want to go like I'm gonna chill like after work I ain't doing shit. I want to chill and then before work I'm just like I have I know I have like the whole morning but I'm like I have to get up early and like fucking go to this and then so to get up early I have to go to bed early so then after work I'm like I gotta get to bed and I'm just like then I have just no time to like en- enjoy what Speaking I want to do masses. and like people I mean I know there are people that enjoy the gym so like going like oh but I enjoy going to the gym that's cool like I don't like I would I, I don't do. mind going to the gym but I just I'm like there's so many like there's just so much time that gets filled up like if i like let's say i don't know i feel like to me i if i had me and jen have talked about this too i that actually i kind of want to spend the money else. and like kind of build an at-home gym i yeah. would use that if i could walk downstairs do like a 45 minute workout walk upstairs and shower and i just that I'd was work, an hour i'd work out with you so my brother alex has like a badass gym oh. he doesn't go to Gyms. He's got his own gym yeah, in his basement. It's exactly. fucking. He's That's got a I squat want. rack. He has two other ben- mm-hmm. couple benches, six benches. I yeah. make fun of him for it. Me and Jen have like talked about like, I was like, yeah, I, I would kind of be interested in like spending the money and just getting like a decent amount of like weights and then a few different things and then you could have like a and then I could just do like little work. Like I'm not trying to become like an elite, like you said, an elite athlete. But if I could just do little workouts like every day or like skip a couple days, you know what I mean? But yeah. I'm like working out, moving Feel around. Better. Yeah, and then like I'll be somewhat. I mean, like my body, I'm pretty, like I'm pretty, pretty uh, fortunate, and like I can just eat whatever I want, yeah. and I like don't get. That was another point I was stuff. gonna say to that guy's video is like, say me and you, we are actually genetically kind of gifted yeah. that we can go on a f- crazy food like food bender, eating a ton of trash, yeah. and literally to me, I feel like maybe my. My, Man, I just, my hips and I my sides like a little bit. Like I don't Corey, like, Corey feels I don't, like shit. I, don't I, don't like I get, feel like I get like a tiny bit yeah. of like love handles. I mean, I'm definitely like not in shape. Like I'm yeah. not like, oh, dude, he's like pretty peak performance. Like, but <laughs> I could, you know, I do like, I don't know. It's just fucking having a job sucks. Yep. And that's where I'm at here, boys. I would love, I just want like a, I was talking to Jen about it. I was like, I just want like an at home. Like, I honestly don't really care what you I'm got doing. The basement. No, no, not like a gym, but like, oh, yeah. I don't really care. I'm talking about like, like a job. I just like want a job where it's like, oh, you can yeah. work from home. You uh, don't even care. Why do those logistics places, some of those places are letting yeah, people work from home? I need like Marketing, something that would, pay, some that would like match shit. my pay a little bit, you know? You might you might be able to in some of those places. Yeah. I need to look around. And I would be scared to, to like. place to give me a raise. Yeah. And so I would be scared to get in like a shitty company, you know? Like, I don't want to be like, like, oh, this, I mean. Honestly, it's like not like my work is great, but like I just what has me is like the benefits are good, and then like you know whatever blah blah blah. This is stupid. You check this out. This ain't funny. Oh, this me. <laughs> you took me out. <laughs> this ain't funny. Boy, you just <laughs> muted. Me. I did. Uh, you back? Mute, did you mute me or did you? I, did, I muted you. Oh okay. Yeah, I can just take it off. Like watch. No, I didn't know if hey. you. I hey. didn't. What I was wondering is if you muted my headphones or muted my mic. Hmm. I'm not sure. 
<laughs> I don't. I don't go back and listen to it. The it's one. the mute. Oh, this is like, maybe I don't know. I can hear you. Can you hear you? Maybe it's not recording the hearing the thing. We should get the manual out. I don't know. Break out the manual. Hey, everybody, Dude, break I, it out. I had to go out to my garage, and then I was like, I had to get the the what kind of lawnmower do I got? And then I had to order the air filter. I feel like a uh, I feel like a real man. I'm a real boy. I'm gonna be really upset though if this doesn't fix it. So, <laughs> uh, so my I had a lawnmower before where the spark plug was black like that, and it was um there was like a leak. So, it, if you got a new spark plug, it so you did that right, and it mm. didn't work. Yeah, I didn't know. So I'd get a new start spark plug. It it would usually maybe start like once, but then it would burn that again, and it would be black. Yeah, and then they told me there was like a leak or some issue somewhere. That was a well. This, more so the lawnmower anymore. like runs. Old, old one. And then last yesterday, I took the spark plug out again, and it was just perfectly fine. It wasn't wet or anything, so I was like, okay. So I don't know. It's all good. I'll get it done. But so Corey Watts, Corey started uh, Obi Wan Kenobi. I didn't. Oh, uh, you didn't. Uh, for some reason, I, I thought you start started anything. that, and then I started Stranger Things. No, I didn't start anything because Jen's gone. I would love to start all of it. So Jordan goes, "Don't tell Corey anything. You'll you ruin it." I go, well, "I'm not gonna just." text him what the episode was <laughs> i go all i wanted to tell you was she's like i know you're retarded <laughs> um yeah i know you don't understand things <laughs> things are difficult for you at times but you have to think f- about others point of view oh um, <laughs> <laughs> and uh no there's a person named chrissy in the show that's like introduced i don't know if they're in there or not in there before I don't, I don't know. Sometimes I see somebody, I go, were they in there before? Yeah. Were they in the last season? It, there's just kids in the background, I don't know. But there's like a demon that you randomly hear. It's just like, Chrissy. And then, really? Yeah, and so oh I was like, God. great, now I'm just going to be hearing that in my dreams. Chrissy. Yeah. Chrissy pissy. I can't uh, have this coffee, apparently. Why? Are you farting? I'm fucking farting. Oh. No, I just feel like I got like gargle gargle nuts. Um, a Rogan spot all the time because no one's ever heard of him. He, he'll be like, "Oh, the black, uh, <coughs> the black rifle coffee," uh, and he'll be talking about how it's the cream or whatever. But I feel like that oh, with really? this. Oh. I'm just trying this new almond milk creamer. Huh? And I, I don't got know, a I'm not doing. I'm not <laughs> dealing with anything. I don't think. I think I need water. We'll get water. Uh. Get him water. That's what oh. we need. A pro- we need a producer, dude. Another part of uh, Stranger Things. It's not even a part of the show, really. But they have a trigger warning in the very beginning. So like Jordan heard about it because she can't get off of BuzzFeed. Was it a trigger warning or was it a different warning? <laughs> it was a tr- trigger warning, and it goes. <laughs> All right, trigger warning. And <laughs> that's welcome to the trigger warning segment. <laughs> <laughs> Where is it at? Which one was the it? bottom? <laughs> oh. I blew it. I kind of wanted to hit it because it's funny. <laughs> but, uh, trigger warning segment. How was the pod? You guys were doing a lot of screaming. Yeah. I was scared. I was triggered upstairs. Hey, wait, is she, so when she's listening to this, are you in the shower right now? Are you thinking of? Oh, she might be at work now. Oh yeah, so she starts to listen to stuff at work too. Oh, yeah. that person that just walked behind you is gay. Yeah, did you get those reports in? Get those reports in, you report, bitch. Sorry. How would you get back to work, you fucking bitch? Get to work. Get to, get to work. Fucking milling around, lollygagging. Hey, quit milling around at work. I love milling around at milling work. Milling around. Anyway. She get a shirt, milling Trig- around. Trigger so, warning. Yeah. Beca- it says, this was recorded like over a year ago, a year and a half ago. But in recent events, like the Texas shooting, that was literally like days ago. Oh. Uh, it says in recent events, like they're like basically saying like there are dead kids in the in the show. Sick. And it just said, like, and then, uh, so, because. 
Ain't no kid like a dead kid. Because there's uh, warnings mm. on other things that I felt like haven't been warranted, my initial, like, uh, thought response to that is like, oh, it'll be yeah, all right. It'll be fine. And then they just... And it was fine. <laughs> they're showing, like, fucking dead kids. Yeah. And it's not as, like, fine as I thought it would be. I was like, oh, they needed that, actually. That's kind of fucked yeah. up. I, mean, I couldn't imagine I like, holy that. shit. I can imagine that would be traumatizing to some people. Yeah. But, I mean, even me, I'm not even connected. I just, I literally couldn't stop thinking about the recent events. I'm not even connected to this shit. Yeah. And I was I just mean, watching, and I, I was like, man. Feel. No, I'm just kidding. I was like, man, this is, this is wild. Yeah, that's crazy. I don't, I even mean, thought, I don't really like, even, crazy. I honestly, like, didn't even watch, like, all the news shit that came out. I didn't watch, like, any of the videos, because I was just like, I, just, I don't want to, like. What are you talking about? The Texas thing. Oh, I watched nothing. Yeah, I didn't watch anything. I purposely don't watch any of this. So shit. I was like, I mean, like, I would see, like, a clip for, like, a second, and then I'd be like, eh. Because I'm just like, it's going to, I like, I, I'm reading stuff, so I'm like, I know what happened. And then, like, I know, and then, like, there's just so many videos of, like, the police are stopping them. And I was like, Tuh. I just, like, don't want to watch it. And then the funny thing, I'm bringing this up. I don't want to watch any of this. I watched a 30-minute Jimmy Dore video of him talking about it. And it just, like, pissed me off. I'm yeah. like, Jesus fuck. It was just, like, because it was all about, it wasn't, like, the focus of his video was all about how the police didn't do anything anything yeah. for an hour. There were That's kids crazy. getting killed and they were just outside. Dude, sure. and there's like, they were showing diff- he was showing different interviews of like different like whoever, like different police guys like being interviewed, talking about it. And dude, one of the guys was like, yeah, I mean like, dude, he basically said like, yeah, I mean like, you know, we didn't really push in right away because, like, he was shooting and, like, we, we were at risk of getting shot. And, like, Jimmy Dore's going, yeah, that's, you're supposed to be getting shot to oh save the kids. Yeah. And then there were, like, I think there were, like, nine officers outside the door or something like that. And it was, like, the one guy goes, so they didn't push in because they were afraid of getting shot. Because, like, the guy made it sound like we didn't want him to shoot us and then be able to get out and then harm all the other kids in other rooms. And it was like, and then some guy that was on the show with him goes, so, which I thought was pretty funny. He goes, so this guy is going to kill all nine police officers and then continue on through the school. <laughs> You're like, what is it? Fuck it. And then like, no one yeah. made this joke. I made this joke in my head. I'm like, yo, what is John wick in the room? Yeah. Like what? He might shoot one of you. <clears throat> hey man, he's killing kids. So you signed up to be a police officer. You got to risk your life. That's just what it is. That's You're nuts. to protect and serve, yeah, yeah. not, and then like I don't not, know, uh, and then like Jimmy Dore brought up a thing where like some some uh, this guy who was like a police officer he like quit and then like studied the whole thing and it was like basically like the police officer like training to become a cop is like they're basically like trained to like save themselves and like not. So it's like, yeah. And then like, then he brought up like Obama was quoted once, and it was like, oh, the cop's oh, yeah. duty is to like them to get home safe. And then yeah. like, I've heard oh Jimmy Dore God. talk about it before because he goes, no, his duty is so I get home safe, yeah. not so he gets home safe. And I'm like, that, I mean, that's fucking true. Yeah. You signed up to be a police officer. <laughs> you, <laughs> citizens are killing each other. Yeah, you got to go. Someone's killing citizens. Who else do we get? Yeah, you're 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 the nine one one. Dude, and then I saw a different thing. It was like a Reddit post, and it was like. Uh, like current or like you know retired police officers like what like what are your feelings about like how the police handle this and it was just like a bunch of different and then like some guy was like I'm so fucking like pissed off right now and he was like talking about like they should like talking about like the guy the head guy's like he should be fired like immediately and then one guy I thought this was a good point he goes I mean after this if this happens again parents are just going to start showing up to these things with guns and doing them all themselves like they completely like and I was like that I mean, that's true. They just fucked. Like, they if there's are. any active shooter situation now, people are going to go, well, the cops aren't going to do it. And then people are just going to show up with, dude, oh, man, parents just coming in Think with Think about gu- all these people dude, who which have guns. It's not they're, good. They're gonna You're go just going to have a bunch of untrained parents running into, because uh, supposedly the police are trained. Yeah. Parents are just going to be running into fucking guns, just shooting up to yeah, fucking they kill. They the top gun ones. Which I don't blame them. If I had a kid, I would be running in that school with a gun. I'm like, well, you're not killing my kid, you know? So, that's all I was you think there's a grand Fuck conspiracy up, that this shit's only happening so that everyone only does everything from home, work from home? Dude, I saw a thing that school, was like... School from home. Everyone stay at home. You don't get shot. Stay at a, home. You play your VR. Yeah. Being a, That'd be cool. No. Never leave. You That's a, I saw a thing like that Wally. was like... 
there's all these like um like active shooter like like programs you can like sign up for like security programs and yeah. like stuff that like tells you how to do everything and i was like obviously those cost money and it was like i mean they're literally like making money off of like active shooter situations so like if we didn't have, have active shooter situations then these companies like couldn't exist and it's kind of like i mean that's like fucked up yeah so it's like People, I don't know. I saw yeah, like, it was yeah. like, oh, are they like trying to make it so like, oh, they like still happen? Because like nobody, they don't want to take guns off the table. They just want to do everything else. But, <laughs> dude, uh, Steve Kerr was like crying after a, yeah, I, I saw, saw it. Yeah, you know? that, that, a bunch was, of other stuff. That was like everywhere. Yeah, yeah, I saw that one everywhere. That's what I see. I just see the few things that go everywhere because yeah. I purposely try not to look at anything. Yeah. And then there's a guy at my work. It's a sad country. That's my new song that I'm writing. God's country. That's what we need on here. Yeah, you're right. Dude. We have an episode. Uh, this is God's country. We have an episode that gets a lot of listens because, because it's, it's titled God's country. That's amazing. And I think people are like, oh, I'll check out that song. <laughs> yeah, dude. God. Well, this is God's country. Jesus is my savior. Corey on the ones and twos. Do we need someone? So we still control this, but we have one more person who's like on a laptop for us. And then maybe we can even have them plugged into here. Yeah. And then, but we control, like, we have it muted so they can't just be crazy. And we have their mic muted so they can't. You can just chime hey, in whatever you want. Yeah. So I don't know. That'd be cool. But we don't have anybody who. Ian one time expressed like interest, but I'm just like, I mean, like wrangling someone and a third person. Hey, third we're doing person. it now. Come on. Yeah. Uh, be paying that. I mean, every once in a while, we could just come on in. That'd be cool. We got a producer today. We'd have my brother do it. So what we, we need, him, and what he's we just need like, him for? I don't know if we need to still look stuff up on the internet. Yeah, you're right. But sometimes we're like, wait, what was that thing? You think Drew would do that? Drew would love to do that. And then I feel like he'd he'd be like, Chuck, he'd try to do, he'd be talking. Uh, well, actually, I mean. Yeah, that's, why, that's why you just hit that little button. I thought about. Uh, having some friends on just to have like a gut, like a change of pace. Having a friend on sometime. Pace. Yeah. You know, different dynamic. Hanging out, party. Get a friend on. Should get my dad on here. Dude, have your dad on here. Okay, hold on. Have your dad on here for like a half hour. Yes. Everything's fine. And then we're like, so. And then he's just like. He just kills us. Ray Street Park, look it up. Wherever you get music, dude. Ray Street. You want some sick dad rock. Ray Street. You want some sick dad rock, dude. You got that right there. Yes. This is God Country. God's titties. This is God's titties. You need to put you need to put the beep on every bank. I know. We have too many. I think we need to consolidate All to right. one. Well, which one gets off of this one? We want to take. It slipped. I just ate popcorn. Take popcorn yeah, that off. could be gone. Okay. <laughs> I think both. Yeah, I'll make football, a note. The both football ones could be gone. Well, hey, actually, I could fucking the beep thing can be added at all times. This is God country. This is. I just had pop- popcorn. <laughs> What's um, the top one? Click this one. Watch popcorn, and then you just go. Replace it. Replacing. Replace. And now you go back. Nice. What's this one? Oh, wait, I already know that one. What's this one? Oh, <laughs> that one stays. He is. Why can't I be caught up? Yeah, that can go too. <laughs> so we got to put like so what do you want God's country. <laughs> this is God's country. And then we got to do like a quote. Yeah, why can't I be caught up? We need like a funny quote from something. I don't even know. I like my father's gay. My father's gay. Even though we can't just rip it off, so. No, I don't want to do that. Hey, uh, so talked about Ben swinging the shit bag. Um, I went suit shopping. Suit shopping's a lot of money. Dude, I like suits. Suits are. Cool. I like the I like the show Suits, the USA Network, about the lawyers. Just kidding. Suits. Ne- never seen one episode of it. Uh, Aiden Hutchinson's sister, uh, Araya <sighs> Hutchinson. She's Miss Michigan. Boring. Yep, that's something. Uh, leaked Madden ratings. Hawkinson's uh, 88 overall. Okay, first of all, Madden's going to suck again. I know, I was just, you know. It makes me upset. Ray Liotta 
All right, yeah, Chantix. Poor little Ray Liotta. <laughs> Let's make a Ray Liotta fucking country song. We're going to miss you, Ray Liotta. <laughs> we're we're going to miss you, Ray Liotta. <laughs> oh, he actually died. Yeah, the He's CKY one good. just fits in so many things. Uh, yeah. It just feels good. Yeah. It's a good feel. All right. Uh, we're going to go through the obituaries. <laughs> I love how you can uh, you just say whatever and then hit it with the CKY and just like it's pretty good. Dude, that is something. Just go Dude, through. You know, go through obituaries. I went, I went suit shopping. All right, we got our next segment. We're gonna do, we do it. This is our versus segment. Okay, who would win this versus that? Pirates versus ninjas. Who ninjas. wins? Ninjas. Ninjas. Wait, no doubt. I don't know. Pirates have a gun. Yeah, shit. But ninjas, it's dark out. Well, depending on what are we... Are, it's just an even... Are they, like, on a... Are they on, like, a well, I think stage? pirates don't leave pirate boats, do they? Yeah, they just can't leave the boat. Yeah, they gotta leave the boat. <laughs> they ever leave boats? Yeah, they leave the boat. They go to, like, the pirate... They hang like, their ass off to shit? Like those, have you ever seen Pirates of the Caribbean? They go to, like, islands I, ha- and I, shit. I don't think I really have. I oh, had it on, and I've fallen asleep. Well, were you I was like, with Amber Heard? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I stand with Amber Heard. Yeah, I'm not fucking <laughs> watching this. I stand. Amber Heard. Dude, you know what another I thing I shit is? on beds. I shit on coats. It's so funny. People are just like, she needs to be cut out of Aquaman. And I'm, like, I'm just like, shut the fuck up. Who cares? And I don't, I'm not going to ever watch that either, personally. Yeah. First so of all, who cares? Care. Let her be in it. It's fine. I don't care anymore. Let's well, just going to cut Bill Cosby out of the Cosby yeah, show? what the fuck? <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I just got overloaded. <laughs> I fat fingered. <laughs> You're a fat finger. They call me That one could probably go. That's good. <laughs> I don't know. Just exploding brains. People are like, this is why I can't listen. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Dude, I, have, I had no problem listening to a couple episodes. Okay, they got some couple days. Oh, they talked about politics for a second. Dead kids. Oh, they, they can be serious for a second. Dead. And and mourn death. And then, couple of those, it's going to Jurassic Park. <laughs> like, what the fuck's going on? What is happening? No. <laughs> I was about to be dead. Uh Dude, so yeah, pirates versus ninjas. Ninjas win, I think. Dude, how about that? Like, people have those shows, and it's like a 30 minute show, and they're like, we're doing pirates versus ninjas. I don't think that's a show, but. Dude, they did have that. Okay, they did. Yeah, they, they had, had like, the 100 like, warriors. Like, we're going to have like knights. We have a knight versus. They break it down. Fucking... They're like, there's a shield. And I was like, this is like the show I wanted as a child yeah. my whole life. Yeah, but now I'm like grown up, and I'm like, eh, that's kind of stupid. <laughs> yeah. Well, I get I over it right like... away because they'll, they'll be like, you get uh, so there's a point when you get too serious. It's like ah, who cares? Yeah, and then they had a show where they would just test weapons. Yeah, I think, or maybe that was the same show. <laughs> I don't remember. Because it was like it it's gonna the cut. Show. Yeah, they end up doing they that. They like, cut through a pig every time, and they're like, or no, they even no, they have like a ballistics gel like person, and they're like, this is the same like thickness as a person, and we're gonna every episode they explain it to you. Yeah, and like, all right. What would know. suck was uh. Like samurais, just look. stab this body, okay? Yeah, like s- samurais sound so cool to me and look so cool, but then when these guys would break it down, they'd be like, they'd have like samurai versus like the first ever like musket, yeah, shooter guys, and then seventeen seventy sixers, and then you'd find out that like the guys with guns would win or something, and I was yeah. like, that's so lame. Yeah, I just mean, feel like samurai, I mean, pretty much, samurais aren't starting from 100 miles away, I don't think. Anyone, I feel like they probably would yeah, sneak do a you, bit. Does the, does the uh, guy start with his gun loaded? Yeah, so that's... I'm like... If he does, that's and, more he, to and it. he hits his shot. They, they, they put all these situations are set up as, like, I think they're, they're at a certain distance, yeah. and then they go to fight, and it's like, dude, samurais are fighting in the night. No, like I think Kangas Khan. The night. Well, Kangas Khan, dude. Yeah, but they didn't have guns. Yeah, but they came on. So yeah, they, but, just, they would just fucking go. Yeah, maybe. I mean, I don't know. Maybe. But they, maybe they'd be smarter. A couple of people die from guns, and they're like, "All right, we gotta come at night, and we gotta fucking get them while they're sleeping." Yeah. Samurais are fucking you up while you're sleeping. So yeah, but then, right. but then you could do like another thing, like 
Yeah, when the samurais come while they're sleeping, the people are actually like awake and waiting for them. And then when they come into the village, they get shot. Yeah, they, they, yeah. You just have to paint it. And they do break you just that have down. To paint in those the shows. advantage to whoever, you know. Yeah, you're right. I am right. I'm, just, I'm right. It just feels kind of lame, you know? The, uh, like, oh, that boring fucking guy with a white wig and a, and a oh, hold on, let me, let me reload this. He's putting powder or whatever the fuck yeah, they're well. doing. Well, uh, I'm just saying, me. the show was, the show ended up being like, ah, that's dumb. Who would win? I get annoyed a guy with, with an M4 or a samurai, and the guy's just, fight! Dude, then, like, the episodes they got now, have you sh- seen the newest season of that show? The newest season, they're like, uh, an armed... Uh, 18 year old and then like 19 kids in a class they had an episode like that i was like the fuck are they doing who would win yeah and then that guy and then that guy saw that and went i'll fucking test it out yeah (laughs) so i mean that show created it's not video games yeah that fucked up show i did see a thing where a guy blamed it on video games and rap music (laughs) Uh, oh that was a funny thing with uh like some older movies you watch from the seventies, eighties, nineties. There's things back then where they're like, like you know, they're playing Black Sabbath, and it's just the first time they heard like a heavy riff, and then they just go. The parents are like, "This is what's making people kill people." <laughs> so they always just change it. Yeah. They're like, now it's games. Yeah. Now it's podcasts. Podcasts are killing people. Let's take a break to just say one thing. Jordan, get back to work. She's probably, uh, she's probably just slacking off right now. Probably, dude. She's like, I've learned what I could get away with. You're I'm not sit, w- just sitting in a chair all day. Go yeah. take the stairs and use the bathroom. Don't don't buy that purse. Don't click don't. Yeah. add to cart. Yeah, yeah. hold on. Don't click checkout. Go to your 14th out of your 36 tabs. And close it. And close it. Because <laughs> it's another purse. <laughs> you, ain't, you ain't need it. He don't have it. You ain't gonna have it. Yeah, you don't need it. You don't need it. You ain't gonna have when it. People ask Chris, it. When people ask Chris, oh, where's Jordan's new purse? Chris is gonna go, she don't have she it. She don't have it. Oh, uh, there was a thing I didn't tell you about uh, a while back, like a couple weeks ago. Jordan had a flat. Did I tell you about that? Jordan had a flat. Isn't that cute? So she had a flat. Oh, that's right. And then people just going too much. She texts me about it, and I'm at work. Yeah, I hate this again. <laughs> I'm at work. She texts me. She has a flat. And my first thought is like, all right, well, chill out. Where was she at? At work. Her car was just like, uh, dude, the parking lot's kind of fucked up. There's like holes and shit. So, of course, I think there was like a screw just right into the tire. So, I was gonna go change it. You know, to change it, change it. Yeah. And that was my initial thought. And then she's like, oh, I have AAA. And then I think I was. Talking to someone at work, someone was like, "Oh, she's got AAA. Just have tri- AAA. They pay. They do it. Yeah, they just let do them it. do it. Yeah, they're like, all right, yeah, th- they'll tow it right to Bell Tire, or they'll change it, and you can go right to Bell Tire and get get it fixed or whatever, mm-hmm. and uh, get like the a new tire or whatever the hell the case is. And so I was like, all right, that does sound good. I don't have to do anything. Mm-hmm. Um, it, this is already paid for. They have that insurance, so why not? So. We do, we do that. She calls. The lady says she's going to be there at this one time. So we show up. Um, it's an empty parking lot after hours. Like, no one's in the parking lot because no one's working. It's, like, 6 yeah. p.m. Yeah. And so I just, you know, the, this lady's in there with a giant truck, uh, uh, like, uh, you know, tow truck. And I park. Oh, so you went there? Yeah, so I, I took Jordan uh, there. Yeah. And then me and her got out, and then she was like, is this the car? And we're like, yeah. So we get out and she's gonna do whatever. Is this a car? Yeah, I you just slowly look around. Well, there was so many things. <laughs> this is kidding. why I'm. This lady uh, is the whole thing. So like this lady, I get out and she goes, "You're double parked." The lady. The lady goes, "You're double parked." And then you go, "A and parking lot boss." <laughs> yeah, dude. Ultimate, immediately, in my head. Is that a joke? Yeah. <laughs> you think you're funny? 
just immediately, I'm like, you suck. You chooch. What, whatever you're doing sucks. You chooch. Whatever you're doing sucks. Oh, you're double parked. And I was like, ha And then, uh, and then later she said something. She's like, well, she asked something about, uh, you know, the tire or something. And then she was like, huh. Well, I mean, I wouldn't expect him uh, to blah, blah, blah. He, he was double parked. And I'm like, Dude, what is wrong with this fucking person? What? Yeah, she's like fucking nuts. Dude, I hate her. And she was like nice in other ways, but so weird to me. And to me, she, she just hates men. I think she, um, so that might that might be a thing because she at one point at one point she starts to oh yeah she goes to put the jack under <clears throat> she kind of can't get it under there and then. Like, like it was raining earlier, so like the the ground's wet. So that's another thing where I'm like, yeah, you you do it. You pay. We pay you to fucking yeah. do this thing. And she's like, oh, could you see if that's under there? And, I, and I'm like, what? We had you come out. You do this. Yeah. I, I honestly don't think if there was any other towing ma- man in the world, would he ask me? Yeah. Oh, get under there. You look at it. Could yeah. you do that? You double park. You do this. If. He would just be doing it. They'd probably not be talking. Yeah. A lot of these dudes just don't say a fucking yeah. word. They're like weird dudes, and they just, I mean, it's sort of a weird field. I, I worked with a couple dudes with Roush, and uh, a couple of them, I mean, pretty calm dudes, but they're not big talkers. They just chain the thick car up, or they're t- and tow it, or change the tire, whatever they do, uh, and then they leave. Like, they aren't like big talkers, at least the dudes I've dealt with. And uh, she, you should, so she you should was, have just been like, you know what? I'll just do it. Bye. I really felt like that. Yeah, I really did. I was like, but then I part of me, I was like, kind of annoyed. I'm like, no, you fuck, in my head, you fucking do it. You're yeah. the fucking person we called. And then she's like, yeah, I would tow it, but you know, I'm looking at it now, and uh, I don't have to do that. I could, I could, I could, I could change the, t- you know, put the spare on, and then we could go. Like, the idea of getting them, she has yeah. a giant tow, tow truck. Do you not know how the tow truck works? Couldn't you just latch a thing? You put it on, like, so that, like, annoyed me, too. I'm like, you're not even doing the tow truck thing that we thought was happening. Uh, you're just having us change it. I would have just changed it. So, like, also, I'm sitting there annoyed because I'm like, I could have changed this. <clears throat> the lady, so she goes, can back to the part where she says, can you look, can you look at it? She goes, can you look at it and tell me if it's straight? She goes, I can't tell if it's straight or not because I'm not. Just to, had to tell me she's a lesbian. <laughs> like, Okay. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, she hates guys. Yeah, I was like, okay. Uh, That's what it was. And then I laughed. I was like, she's kind of, uh, you know, that was, That's pretty guess, funny. funny. But, like, also it was just like, it wasn't, it was weird. And then she's kind of awkward. And she, to me, looks like someone who's, like, on and off some drugs and shit. Yeah. Had, like, a rough upbringing. This is, like, what she looks like. She's just, like, uh, she's very silly and weird. But, uh, yeah, and you double parked. <laughs> okay. And then. Uh, says it over and over. Yeah, and uh, when I grabbed the spare, I grabbed one of those. I go, see if, I said, that I was just saying to Jordan. I wasn't even, like, telling this lady. She's doing her thing. She, like, walks by, and she's, like, psychoanalyzing me five feet away. Like, Any word you hear, she's yeah. like, no, double parked. And then uh. I, said to, <laughs> I said to Jordan, I, I went, see, like, if it was just me and you, I would have to use this stand. And then she was like, please, never use those stands. And I know they're not great. They, yeah. They're terrible. They're terrible. Never jackstones. use it. And I'm just like, well, what if like I have that? To? Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, so everything she said, I'm like, you're dumb. Yeah. You're kind of an idiot with everything. She's you're like saying. trying to like flex her changing tire. Now you don't even know how to tow. Asking for help, but also like telling you not to use it. Also thing. doing like some weird flexing stuff. I'm like, your job sucks. And I know it sucks. And I know you don't want like it. Yeah. <sighs> and then she, oh yeah. And then she mentioned being on overtime and, ha- and it kind of being a bummer. Being brought out here, and I was like, I, I don't care. I we don't, don't care. give a fuck. Yeah, we paid for the insurance. We need you to do the job and fucking get the fuck out of here. Yeah, I don't need you to. Dial Jordan's like, load. she was nice. I was like, you said that because she's a lesbian and you don't want to be. She was nice. Uh, well, bigot, bigot. from what you told me, <laughs> she didn't sound nice to me. Yeah, uh, I was like, this lady sucks. She's probably mad because. I double parked. She, you were there, and she probably just wanted Jordan just there alone. Right, yeah, she probably, she probably would have fu- fucking les raped her. Jordan, I saved, I saved Jordan's holes. Yeah, I'm assuming, I'm assuming she was like a beefier lesbian. Nope. Oh, really? Yeah, she was like Jordan's size. Oh, was she like maybe maybe forty seven? Like no, 
She was like our age. <laughs> what? I was blowing my mind right now. Yeah. I think like if she didn't have a rough upbringing, she'd look a little better. She uh, like looks rough. Oh, okay. She's like around our age or whatever, but she looked like she'd been through shit. <laughs> She's like, just assuming she had a rough upbringing. She's like, I mean, you can't, I don't think anyone would look and be like, no, I think she was fine. What if she had a totally great upbringing, fine. but like she's the only one in her family? They're like, I don't know what happened to her. <laughs> I guess that could happen because I mean, I see like family members where I'm like, huh? Yeah. That, you're, you, turn, you ended up like that? I thought you were different. Than, I mean, I don't know. But. Well, what about this? Yeah, that was my only note I put down on the thing. Yeah, we called a, a, AAA, and then she's like, I, I can't tell if it's straight because I'm not. I was like, I'm telling everybody this. <laughs> That's pretty good. <laughs> That's pretty freaking good. Hey! Oh, yeah. So what, what do we got here? Okay, we're doing good. R.I.P. Ray Liotta. Just a, that was a little moment of... People do mo- moments of silence. We do moments of CKY. Yeah. For people. Da-da-da-da. Moments of CKY. Did you know that the press... Of, oh, my God. Just mixed words. Stroke. The Fresh <laughs> Prince of Bel-Air. Like, they have that drama show. Oh, yeah. Do you see the commercial for that? Yeah, the Bel-Air or whatever it's called. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Like, what other shows... Could you think about that, or maybe movies or shows that are funny? Oh, you could like dramatize. Yeah, but um, I don't want to. I don't even want that to be dramatized. Chris it's, is like, I need more. I heard someone say it's good, but I just, why was that an idea? It's so weird. Like we're rehashing things, we're bringing that show back, we're making a sequel of that, and I know everyone's talked about that, and it's like almost tired even talking about it. But Fresh Prince of Bel Air being a drama, I'm like, why? Dude, it was could, already done good, and it had drama parts. Also, ha- you was could funny. dramatize uh, Dumb and Dumber. Who's the boss with Tony Danza? Remember that show where he lived with like that uh, rich lady and like her kids, and then I think he had a daughter, but he was like a garbage man. And it was like, who's the boss? The show's called Who's the Boss. It was an older show. Yeah, I've never watched it. I mean, my, I didn't yeah. watch it. My, I was little. My parents would watch yeah. it. Yeah, but you go. Know, you could dramatize that one, and then can you put SpongeBob on? He like rapes her. One episode, and I'm like, oh, my God. How are we you dramatize do? everything. Yeah. Oh, it's so sad. The world's too sad. We need more funny. I agree. We got all this fucked up shit going we on. We need People more need funny to be... or more Star Wars. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> more Star Wars. There are actually a lot of people who are like, I need, like, they, I think it bothers them. Oh, yeah. They're like, really? I didn't even think the one in the 80s was good. Oh, yeah. And well, they keep doing it. There's people who are like, people dude, like they're just stuff. making too much. Which, I mean, they are making just so much. But but then in my head, I'm just like, I'm going to keep watching it. I'm going to I'm gonna agree with you and go, I mean, yeah, they're making too much. Yeah. And then I'm going to go, and now I'm going to go watch it and hope that it's good. Yeah. Because like, even I mean, like the, Mar- fun, even fun the Marvel stuff, it's like, there's so much of it. There's too much. They're making too much. And it's like, I mean, I agree. But some of it's really good. And so I'm going to watch it. Yeah, and then go. Yeah, I mean, I agree. There's too much, but they're gonna make. They're gonna make it, and then we're all gonna consume it, and they're gonna make tons of money, and then they're still gonna make more, and then we're gonna consume it. Yeah, it's just gonna be a cycle. So it's just, I don't know. I'm already thinking about. So I heard that Stranger Things, the newest season, is just like seven episodes, Mm -hmm. and then they're doing like another. They're calling it. All the seasons have been small episodes. Uh, Like I didn't even realize, but I was just looking at it. It's like nine, eight, eight, seven. One seven seasons of just one yeah. episode, season one. I go like this. Like episode uh, season five, episode one is all they have. Um, but they're probably gonna do that. I bet you five, ten years. Netflix is gonna be like, we're struggling. Stranger Things have to come back. None of the people, in the, none of them are gonna want to come back other than Winona Ryder because nothing's going Dude, on. Netflix they're gonna bring like only has Stranger Things. They're falling apart. They're, yeah. they're gonna bring. They're gonna. I'm already projecting. They're gonna bring. Recording. Yeah. Hot on the prior. <laughs> we can't do it like as fast as you want. Yeah. Um. <laughs> no, because like all their hot shows were like <laughs> The Office, and it's yeah, like not no, their seriously. show. And then like no. Marvel shows were like yeah that. They just lost. That was the reason Disney. people hopped on. Yeah, then now they just don't have any. They have garbage. That, this Netflix original. And people are like, yeah, I don't want to watch it. John Wayne Gacy. And everyone's like, we know. Yeah. There's like already yeah. three other documentaries about it. Yeah. Oh, you got the tapes? <laughs> you guys got a couple tapes? Oh, you got the tapes? Cool. 
You guys got the tapes. Um, but no, it's I already know it's gonna happen. Fucking okay. write it down. Okay. They're gonna bring Stranger Things back. Yeah, it's not gone yet, but the, they already were saying that they're gonna end it soon. But I'm already projecting they're they're gonna almost ruin the name because they're gonna bring it back in the they're future. Gonna be like adults. There's well, no, they're not even gonna be they're able to bring up. all the actors back. There's gonna be like one or two. Yeah, nothing's he's going on. Gay and he died. <laughs> there's a bunch of them aren't gonna come back because yeah. they're. They'll not have doing like that. They'll have like one or two of them, and then they'll fill all the they're other, not gonna get paid other people. Enough. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. They're gonna, it's going to be Winona Ryder teaching a class, and she's like, "Hey, put the lights on the wall, the lights, the letters." And that's then, how I found my son. They, they talk to you, and everyone's like, "Oh God!" But he just came in here and went, "Wait, what is going on? <clears throat> What are you talking about? Body's here. Body's a cat." That was weird. All right. Um, what the hell? Oh, but I did think of Dumb and Dumber being dramatized. Oh, my God. That would, I don't even... <laughs> like, just two retards, yeah. like, trying to get to fucking Aspen <laughs> to give the... And it, I think I'm going to fall in love. No, there's bigotry all over. Yeah. Like, uh, not bigot. No, what would it be? I don't know. People are just like hating on them and not letting them get on buses or nothing. They're like, yeah, you can't nah, do this. You can't get on this <laughs> bus, you <laughs> dumb piece of shit. But like they're uh, in the airport. They get detained. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he It's would. super serious. Just runs through the off the tarmac or yeah. off the jet bridge under yeah. the tarmac. They're, they get beaten. Sir, you can't go in there. It's okay. Yeah. I'm a limo driver. <laughs> run I feel like that fit with it's okay. I'm a limo driver. <laughs> it just fits with too many things. It's sick. She was coughing. I know. Her cough. He's just taking your soul right now. Dude. Dude, cats have dinosaur eyes. Anyone ever thought about that? Look at those eyes. You don't want to bring my dog here? Those are eyes of dinosaurs. Those green fucking vagina eyes. Why is this staring at The little me? slits. Why is this staring at me? Is he going to get me? No. <laughs> he's sizing you up. Uh, he's got Try s- something, bitch. He's got small arms. I you remember it. Frankie? <laughs> yeah. Uh. What if when he walked in the room, he was in slow motion? He could have been. He's just eating a leaf. I'm a vegetarian cat. Diesel comes in, he just, his neck is longer. He just reaches up to that leaf. <laughs> just eats the plant on the top shelf. <laughs> Nobody can see, but we're reenacting dinosaurs <laughs> eating leaves. <laughs> and then uh, after that, Diesel walks in. Just lard as shit. You got a bag of Carl's Jr. <laughs> Dude, where do we get that? I don't know. Dude, diesel yeah. trucks all around town. Diesel owns a couple trunking companies. Dude, so when you mow the lawn, you have to fucking move that hammock thing? Yeah, you I actually put it back there. It was the annoying to move. I used to leave it on that pad and move it on the pad, and then that got annoying. So uh-huh. it's better to have it there. I'll mow one side. I'll throw it to the side, and then I mow the other And then Jordan goes, be careful. Every, every winter, <laughs> before winter, every year, she goes, oh, maybe I should put that away. Like, yeah. you know, take off well, it's fucking three yeah, took, screws, and you yeah. fucking throw it in the bag. I took mine apart and threw it in the garage. But every winter, it stays. It's fucking, like, this thing is going to get ruined. It's shocking, shockingly in good shape. Yeah, mine stays outside, like, all summer. Just like that part, obviously. And then we just take the hammock in and out. And then I put it away. Hell yeah, brother. I never put things away. I'm, put it, put I'm it, a messy it, boy. Put it, put, it, put, it, put it away, dude. Hold on. Before we go. Yeah? Remember, Jordan. Quarterback, you kidding me, coach? Sorry. What? Put your hammock thing away in the winter. There we go. Yeah. We gave, we gave her the message. Remember, when you listen to this. And get back to work. Don't buy that purse. June 24th. What are the what are the things we got going on here? I don't know. There's 40 pages. It's like it's a Rogan page. It was at this moment that oh, he oh knew. Oh yeah. I delete he all those. Up. I actually like truly Despite. hate that one. 
<laughs> well, Dude. this is another one we could change. Oh my you know? god! I just I it's hear. Over nine thousand. Oh, I like that one. Surprise, motherfucker! Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> All the ones that are like already been in like tons of just overused. It sucked because I was looking stuff up and then that's what it's giving you. And I'm like, yeah. uh, one of the that's why I like the over 9,000 because it's not overused. Yeah. That hat makes you look like a girl. Am I a. Yeah, we just delete all those. <laughs> we need to delete every bank. Da -da 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 yeah, we should just make a CKY chart. Yeah, no. We got fucking seven nope. songs and a beep. Just seven songs and a beep. Seven songs and a beep. That's my new band name. It's so much more benefit. Out oh God! <laughs> <laughs> this is the we have Alex on the show, and then just and get then out like, there and go fucking. Dude, I'm telling you, that's what more people need to know. <laughs> you need to get out and do something. People are sitting there, and then like, I need a therapist. I need to fart. No, you need to just get out, get there, out there and go fucking do something. Do it. And yeah. To really appreciate the light. You gotta experience the darkness. Oh god! <laughs> All right, I'm done with the road. I'm out. I thought, I thought this guy was a comedian. Fucking, yeah, it's comedy that he thinks anyone wants to get advice from. Him. All right, guys, that's been the show. <laughs> but it's just like beautiful women, beautiful Amazon women. Amazon. Big tits. Just do Amazon women have big tits? I think that would like get in the way of them being I just call, Amazon. Women. I just call women Amazon women. So you're racist. Not just big women. So you're. So you're sexist. Like Amazon Warriors. Like the basketball team. Yeah, the <laughs> Warriors. All their wives. Cause they're all like six something. Just walking through, crushing towns. Check this out, dude. Good day.